Google Access Channel 96 presents Men on Football. And, and welcome, welcome to, to Men on Football. football. The show that looks at football from a male point of view. That's right, tonight we're live and uncensored. That's right, naked to the world. Peekaboo! <laughs> you know, we have a new sponsor, Wilson Sporting Goods, the official boss of the NFL. <laughs> I ain't said a word. You know, a lot of people were very surprised to hear that we was doing a special football show. But we've been fans of football for many years. I mean, what other game boasts such great names like Dick Butkus? Or my favorite, Bob Greasy. Now, isn't he a tight end? He was. <laughs> There's a lot of things about this game that could be better, mm -hmm. like the uniforms. Hated him, for instance. You know, I was so disappointed when I found out that those numbers on the back, they were just for identification. Oh, I know what you mean. Mm -hmm. The smallest one I saw was 11, mm -hmm. and then I saw one that said 78 child, I almost fainted. <laughs> you need to stop. <laughs> and you know, I found that those padded shoulders were just too Joan Crawford. Mm-hmm, and think, and speaking of old fish, mm -hmm. what about those cheerleaders? Hey, hey them. them. <laughs> I mean, what good are they? Everybody knows that these men just look at each other's for their strength mm -hmm. and inspiration to do their best, not some <laughs> scallop on the sidelines. Look, <laughs> I don't understand why they bring them in. Mm -hmm. And what about this matchup today, the Buffalo Bills against the Washington Redskins? Oh, yes, it's like playing cowboys and Indians. Ooh! Well, tie me up and scout me, but I'd be a lot more entertained if they were playing with the Oilers and Packers. <laughs> That's a thought. <laughs> now, what's your favorite play of the game, Quan? Well, to be truthful, mm -hmm. for me, nothing beats that exquisite moment of tension right before the play begins as the muscular, sweaty football men get down on that line of scrimmage. <laughs> there they is, eyeball to eyeball. Their breaths is coming out like steam from a big bull's nostrils. I just got three words to describe it. Delicious. I'm through. Uh-oh, I think I just sprung a leak. <laughs> Speaking of football, let's bring back that Joe Namath. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'll never forget the time when he put on those pantyhose on national television. It must have taken so much courage for him to come out and say, this is me, this is who I am. Call me Broadway Joe, because that's how I do it. The Broadway. <laughs> time out. Now, you got to reverse that call. Joe Namath is married. Hello? Well, so is Richard Gere, and you should have seen that gerbil in the wedding dress. <laughs> about this part of the game. Now, Blaine, we all know what a red flag in the right pocket means, mm -hmm. but what does the yellow flag in the left pocket mean? Oh, I think those are the wide receivers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but there's so much about this game that's so confusing. Mm -hmm. For instance, why do they stop a play when there's too many men on the field? To me, that's party time. Because, <laughs> Blaine, too many men, that's an illegal formation. Well, if love is wrong, then I don't want to be right. <laughs> and you don't know the first thing about football. And you don't know the first thing about lotion. Well, anyway. Oh, you about to seriously work my last good nerve, ain't you? Don't get mad, Twan. Is that all you? <laughs> you can show me how to play. Teach me. Go ahead. Okay. You have a ball? I think I have one right here. <laughs> I think I played this one before. <laughs> All you have to do is stay hike and take the little blue ball and start running. But isn't that gonna hurt you? Take the ball, Billy, go here, stay hike. Supposed to 
chase me. I don't like this game. <laughs> well, that's our show for this week. But before we go, we'd like to salute all the men playing the Super Bowl with our special Super Bowl snap. Two, Two snaps, snaps and, and your, your back feeling low. <laughs> Join us next week when we're going to review the Olympics. You know, I can't wait to see that little chocolate piece of lightning Carl Lewis doing his thing. Well, you know why Carl runs so fast. You can run, but you can't hide from your true self, Miss Lewis. <laughs> Hello? The books has been read and the library is closed. Yes, Goodbye! <laughs>